at the end of each day, it's amazing how tired we can get from the activities that go on. The work, the chores, all different things, even the things that we enjoy, the recreation. It can wear us out physically and if you're not careful, mentally and spiritually. So God knows exactly what's going on in our lives and he wants us to rest in him. Because you might feel a little haggard, a little tired, but God wants you to enjoy rest and invites you to come unto him and find that rest. Hi, I'm Craig Fritchley, pastor of Calvary Apostolic Tabernacle. Today's devotional. And God wants you to know that you're not alone in this walk in this life, but he's here to help you. And when you team up with the Lord, things can happen in your life that will never happen by yourself. Because we do lose strength. Our strength is limited. We need rest every night. We've got to sleep. God doesn't want us to go 24 hours a day, seven days a week. In fact, he didn't even want us to go seven days a week. He told us we need to rest one day out of seven. So we need to make sure that we follow God's command and we allow him to give us the strength that we need as we do our day-to-day -day activities. God will help us, but we got to make sure that we don't overtax ourselves and we follow what God asks us to do. Jesus said, Come unto me, all ye that are labor and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly, and ye shall find rest unto your souls. God wants you to rest. He wants you to find a place of contentment. He doesn't want you to feel stressed out by everything that's going on. He wants you to trust him and to allow him to help you. So as you see each day ending and the sun sets, just remember, the same God that has the earth orbiting around the sun is the same God that's promised to take care of you. And so rest in the Lord, trust him, allow him to help you, and you will find the strength you need for each and every day. He'll give you what you need. You just have to ask. You've got to follow his, his recipe. Follow what the Word of God says, the blueprint that he's given for us. And allow God to help you as you go throughout each and every day. We hope you share these devotionals with others. If you have a comment or a question, please leave it below. And we'll see you on the next one. And oh, be sure to check out our live streams. It really is um, good information that we have, our services, our music. And we want it to be enjoyable to you. We want to bless you. And we want your life to be fulfilled in the Lord. Have a wonderful day.